have what we think is an enemy location. Then it happened. And in an instant, everything changed. I couldn't move, I couldn't see, I couldn't hear. I just felt searing heat and pain. I could smell my flesh burning. My name is Greg Stubbe, and I'm an American. I don't want sympathy. I knew what I was doing. I'm not confused about it. I wasn't an innocent victim. I was an American warrior. I look back where my personal life really started, my wedding day with Donna. My name is Donna Stubbe. I'm the wife of a Special Forces soldier, and I'm very proud of my husband. I, as a wife, never thought, you know, that he would go through something so terrible. Uh, but I was glad to get a phone call instead of a knock at the door. When I get the opportunity each day to be a citizen here in America, I think about everything it took to get me to this place after 23 years in the Army. I have to give credit to certain things that were with me the whole time. Certain people, certain beliefs, certain core values, and certain pieces of equipment. Very few of them were with me the whole time but the M9 was, and it never failed me. So I, I have to give it credit for what I enjoy today, for what I have today, and the total picture of where my service has brought me. And I believe the way it helped accomplish the freedom that we all enjoy. I'm Greg Stubbe, and I'm the face of the M9.